What's up guys, today we are making our second part on how to make a shooter game in Scratch. So, I have just made the gun a bit lighter and the background gray. And I have set the size to 80% in our player. So, we have our normal dude that can move and shoot as we did in the last tutorial. So, we're making zombies in this tutorial. So, without further ado, let's get started. First, when we want to make a zombie, we need to make a sprite, of course. So, let's make a sprite and let's call it zombie. Create new sprite, call it zombie, and get the circle tool, and get the green color, make it dark a bit, and then change the outline to four. I like four, that's why. Okay, so let's zoom in real big, hold down shift, and you get a perfect circle. Then get the line tool, and change this to ten, and then just draw lines like that. I will change the size to eighty. Okay, so let's get coding. When in flag is clicked. We want to set our size to 80. So I, we don't have you don't have to do this, but just in case we're doing it, and you get a forever loop. We'll point towards the player. So at, what this does, it's all, just pointing towards the player, and that's all. And we put a forever loop around that, so just forever point towards the player. Okay. So let's get a create clone of myself. Create clone of myself, and we'll put a wait 0 0.5 seconds. I would just say one second. We don't have to do 0 0.5 seconds if you don't want to. So let's do a when I start to clone. So what this means, create clone of myself, is going to create the clone of a zombie. And it will wait one second before it does that. So when I start to clone, what we will do, we will put a go to XY. So go to XY and we'll say go to 240, which is the right of the screen. And we want our zombie to... uh go random from the top of the screen to the bottom of the screen so what we do is put a pick random block pick random negative 180 to 180 so what this does it's going to the right of the screen and then it's going to create a clone of over here 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 and random from negative 180 to 180 which is the top of the screen to the bottom of the screen so after when you do that we're going to do some stuff well we're going to put a forever move 10 steps so get, go to motion, put that move 10 steps in, and I'll put move 2 steps. <clears throat> so it moves slow. As you can see, there's our zombies. And they're not always <coughs> facing the player. So what we need to do is put this in here. <coughs> and the one I started as a clone. So it will always point towards the player. So why you see this zombie just standing there? <coughs> well, I'll show you why that is first this is the original one the clones are just doing its job and the original one is not doing anything so what you need to do is put a hide over there and put a show over there so only the clones will show so as you can see we don't have the one standing there and we have our zombies done and we have our spawning done we have our movement done and everything we need to do so peace out 